Okay. I'm gonna do my I'm gonna do my belt for the van. Here we go. All right. First thing I need to take this off. Just pull this whole thing out so I can get to the belt. All right. Lay off that to the side, and my belt is right here. Belt is right here. And this is the tensioner right here. I gotta get a, maybe a, I think that's a half inch and pull it and pull the wrench this way to release the, the tension on the belt and going ahead and uh, re replacing that old belt. That belt is probably at least 10 years old. Let me go ahead and do that and yeah. All right, go ahead and get you a 5 8 ratchet with some uh, extension. Grab you a bungee cord because it's going to be under a lot of tension. So bring it all the way down and somehow secure this so it won't move. Probably, let me, let me figure out where I can put this without it. Uh, probably injuring myself or even worse I guess I can put this okay put this one right here I guess nope it needs to be all the way I'm gonna see if I can get this. Let me see if I can wrap it. Wrap it multiple times. Uh, I don't know where I did. I don't know where I put this the last time. Nope. It needs more. I guess I'm going to put it in this hole right here. Yep. Okay. Since you got that right there. Go ahead and take the belt off. Now I need to go up underneath to fish it out. All right, this is the belt right here. So I got that off. So this belt needs to go through the fan, through the fan. If I can get it. Okay, I'd be right back, hold on. All right. It's you gotta get it around the the fan to pull it out. There's the old one. Uh, I say I could have still used it. I'm gonna keep it just in case. But this is my brand new belt right there. And how you how you put it back? How you put the new belt on? This is the instructions right here. Uh, this is the crankcase right here power steering, the fan, uh, AC compressor. I think that's the pulley itself. And that's the alternator, I think. Or this is the alternator. I think that's the pulley and this is the alternator, I think. Vice versa. So you have to make it go inside the belt, wrap it around. So let me go ahead and do that. All right, this is the part number. K060986. So it should be the right uh right one. Yeah, it's it's pretty long. So this is it. So what you gotta do, you gotta make it go between the belt first 
and then bring it up all the way. So let's go ahead and do that. Put it through here first. Go ahead and wrap it around the belt or the fan. Okay, I finally got it on. It goes around this belt. Then it wraps around the fan, wraps around the, the power steering, and it goes all the way up to the AC compressor. And then it wraps around over here, goes around this pulley. You can see it, that's a pulley. And up there is the, uh, the alternator, and there's another pulley right there. And that's my tool, if you can see it right here that's where I adjust it my goodness I can't see right there is my pulley right there so now to okay it's wrapped around this pulley right here then it goes to the AC compressor right right there that's the alternator and all I have to do is just uh, pretty much let this thing go all right, I'll show you. All right, now as as I let this thing go, okay, all the pressure's on that belt. All right. All right, before you go ahead and start it up, make sure the belt's pretty much tight. Not gonna move. It looks like the belts are on there. I'm gonna just go on every every pulley and see if the belt's on and go up under here again. And make sure Make sure all the belts are good. Because if you start this up, you're going to break this belt. And this belt was expensive. But I do got a, a five year warranty on this. So, so it looks like it's good. And go ahead and put your air filter or your uh, air vent back in. Should just screw in, not screw in, but just should just pop in just like that. Yeah, I need to get another one of these because the screws um, broke, or not the screw, but the, the fitting that fits onto this, and over here it broke. So I need to see if I can find one and make sure you clean up all your mess. See, I got tools over there and I got tools over here, so I need to clean this garage eventually sometime this week all right see if it's gonna start uh, the other day I had to charge this battery up I charged it up for at least eight hours uh, it's been so cold in here in Tennessee uh, I think it's just running my battery dead so here goes nothing I'm gonna not start it I'm gonna just click the engine over once Okay, now I'm gonna turn it off and come back out here and see if the belts are good. See if the belt is good. See if it didn't slip. Okay, the belt is good. Come up under here. Yep, the belt looks good. Yep, the belt looks good, okay. All right, now I can start it. Go ahead and get my keys. They fail, huh? Okay, there goes nothing. It's quiet. There's no squeaking.
looks good. See how there's no, hardly no smoke, no smoke at all. Before I done my head gasket, there was a lot of smoke coming out of here, so that's still good. I'm probably gonna let it run for for a couple, maybe for a couple hours or so. So yeah. All right.